okay, just roar or grunt or anything. Just get up, please. Willow! <gasps> the ice witch! Remember me, Nunu. No, no. Remember the heart of the blue. A fire for the darkness. A candle for the night. You must find it, Nunu. No, no. To find it is to find me, too. Look for the wind mountain. Find the heart of the blue. dreams about mom. When she talks to me in the dreams, it feels like she's still there. Well, she always says, I need to find this heart of the blue. I don't know what the heart of the blue is, but last night, she told me it's in the wind of the mountain.
Well, it's a mountain, and those seem like wings, right? It's almost like a bird? Uh -huh. You're right. We've got to go closer. Let's go. been preserved in the ice. Uh -huh. oh. I was once with mom on her baby wolf ship just like this. Yeah, she told me it was really old, like three sisters were old. It looked just like this. You're ready to lose again. What? I won the last dozen. Oh well, prove me wrong. Ladies and gentlemen, the champions, Nunu of the Mill Time and Willow, the mighty Rotaras. <laughs> Oh, 
a lead, but a lead is a lead. That was good, but we'll never do another Good idea. From up there, we should be able to see the Winged Mountain much better. Let's find a way in. What's that? Exactly. Boom. Now I know what to do with those. Wait for me, Willem. Easy. Hold on, Willem. This is one of those planes that go by fast. Close. 
and fun. <laughs> so what do you think it is, Willem? The heart of the blue. Maybe it's the heart of a giant. It's buried deep below the ice, and it still beats even to this day.
this wall. It looks different, don't you think? Mm -hmm. I don't know. It took me totally by surprise. Did you see that dark stuff all over it? Well, I'm just glad you found me, buddy. against a tiny boy. How mighty! I see a note here. Yes, Willem! It's fell Songer time! Get up there. Yeti catapult. Another song note. That's 
That's a lot of notes. I wonder what they do. size of three Drew Basques. Hey! Maybe the Heart of the Blue is made of true ice! That would be amazing! Could you imagine? Part of the 
What's up with this Anivia statue? Looks different. Whoa! I've never seen Dark Eyes before. Can we use it somehow? Okay, okay, I get the message. Light will reveal the path. What do you mean? Show him eating his enemies. No 
mom would love to see this. Because for my people, the Notai, Anivia is the mother of all. She'd love being here with us. What's wrong? This is definitely the right place. It's called Mountain with Swings. This has to be where Mom wants us to go. Aren't you excited? Really? I'm starting to think you don't want to go. Come on, it'll be fun! others like you. What happened to the Eddies? I'm sorry. It's okay. I was just curious. Demigod, 
and an Ibius Well, uh, after digging up the valleys of the Freljord, he created the snow to go on top. <laughs> right, like icing on a cake. Imagine being able to create snow out of nothing. We can have snowball fights whenever we like. <laughs> ice we saw all over the Anivia statue? Mm -hmm. Do you think that's what's making the ice wolf so angry? Mm -hmm. no, 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 not the statue. The dark ice. The black stuff growing on the ice walls. Sure looked the same. And Mom always said dark ice was bad. Real bad. Mm -hmm. Forget about it. Huh? But if it is dark ice, that's not good. Right? Multi wind chime. We use them to teach songs. Tired. You think this is a good place to make a camp? <laughs> Great. I'll make a fire. Then I might work on that song I've been writing. The one about us. Well, um, I've been working on our song. Should I play it? <laughs> Here we go. taught it to me. I used to do that with Mom, you know. We always sang together. Yeah, she was. She is. Yeah, you know what? You're right. It's funny. As long as I'm looking for the heart of the blue, I feel she's closer. Somehow. Okay then. Mom wants me to find the heart of the blue, so that's what I'll do. Thanks, Willem. I couldn't do it without you, buddy. <laughs> Can you tell me more about the Heart of the Blue, Mom? What do you want to know? What does it do, exactly? Is it like a weapon? Yes, in a way. Oh, cool. Is it a sword? No one ever taught me to use a sword. It's not a sword. Think of the heart of the blue, like a candle. A candle? When evening falls and the chill sets in, what do we do? We light a campfire? Exactly. We fight the cold and the dark with warmth and with light. That's what the Notai have always done. And that's what the heart of the blue is, Nunu. 
A fire for the darkness, a candle for the night. Mom, you always do this. <laughs> do what? You never give me a straight answer. You always want me to figure it out for myself. Maybe that's the best way to learn. Maybe the best way to learn is if you just tell me. Look for the winged mountain, Nunu. You'll find the answers you seek. <gasps> loss. I can only spend so long hiding the dreams of mortals. But this war is yet an island that's secret and unknown to the world. They're looking for a magic relic. Something called the Heart of the Blue. I'm almost certain this is linked with the Yeti's magic. The power to make true ice. The same true ice I used to save the world so long ago. And true ice I need, desperately. The wall I built with true ice is falling. The sigils are melting. The cracks grow deeper and deeper every day. And behind that dark wall, you're there, my oldest foe, the Void. If you break through, it will be the end. You will devour the world. But this Yeti could be my blade against you. And I'm planning to wield it soon.
Yes, yes, I am. <laughs> and who might you two be? I'm Nunu, and this is my best friend, Willem. What brings you out here? The Freljord is wild. Not safe for children. I know. We're looking for the heart of the blue. Maybe you know where it is? My mom told me it was at a winged mountain. Hmm. Brom knows nothing of this heart of the blue, but a winged mountain, you say? Come, follow me. Is. Bad news, it is impossible to get there. But we need to get to the mountain! No, what we need is mighty stew of heroes. A stew? She has a very special recipe handed down by my mother. Is it magic? Mother's recipes are always magic, little one. <laughs> But not like that. No. Eating stew will give us time. Time to think of the solution to the problem of the blizzard. So, what's in it? Where do we get the ingredients? Brom must capture giant boar, gather vegetable from deep underground, and wrestle deadly poison worm for seasoning. There's no big deal. Wow. It's like a quest. So what about me and Willem? You and the uh, giant Boro here, you will go and bring cauldron from the abandoned camp, just down in the valley. A cauldron? Is that it? Oh, come on. This is Quest. Will you accept it, little hero? Sure. I guess. Yes. Then, with Quest's complaint, we will meet back here to share stories of our incredible adventures. Let's go! Fetch a cauldron. Mm. A cauldron? Really? I know the stew is gonna help us figure out the blizzard, but I wish Braun would give us a quest. That's a little... Hmm. legendary, I guess? Ones, Willem. Bo, 
Why, Olivia? Willem, look at this. What is it? It's a no tie camp, Willem. This is my family. My home. I haven't seen a no tie camp since. Yeah, you're right. But still, no tie camp. See how the camp is kind of spread out? That means they plan to settle here for at least a couple weeks. Mom taught me how explorer groups would split off from the main tribe. This must have been one of them. Just look at the caravans. What is that? Over there, on the hill. Do you see it? Mm. We should go take a look. Shovel? A spade? No way! That's definitely a shovel. Let's go take a look. much lava. I know, I know. But if we slip, this won't be like falling in a normal lake. You know? Be careful, buddy. Oh. Whew. That was 
I hear it too. <laughs> it's got a good rhythm to it. Sounds like hammering. Let's go.
Yeah. They seem linked to that wheel over there. Hmm. It looks like those counterweights open those doors. <laughs> of course they do. I think. Stop being so negative.
season or two. Whew, there's gotta be a quicker way. Yes. from a stronghold castle thing, and an offering from the Kellerel, which is in an ice garden. What should we find first? Hmm. Fine, I'll decide. our way into that black fortress.
stronghold. Let's explore it. According to Orn, the jewelberry fruit grows somewhere inside. Creepy. It looks so much like the Frost Guard Citadel. Look at this drawbridge. How do we open it? Yeah. Seems like those signs are holding us. Maybe you're strong enough to move those gears, Willow. Broken. Sorry about that. I see a jamming chain. We need to break it. It won't move. The ice is blocking it. the other side too. Thank <laughs> you. 
on the floor. What is that? You're not quite yourself today, buddy. It, you know that? Wow. So, that's one of the monsters of the void? He looks huge! And creepy. <laughs> no statues. Hearing from above. Wait. I know the story. One was deaf, and one was blind, and one can never speak. The three sisters were the ones who fought against the abyss. And there was one called the Sandra, like the Ice Witch. What do you think of it, Willem? Super exciting, right? <sighs> That's all you have to say? I don't know what got into you with this void stuff. What are those sparkling balls? Nah, don't be afraid. Piece of cake. You'll see. So Orn wanted two things. He got the Joeberry through.
well against the void? Sort of? Okay. So, which is stronger? Dark ice or true ice? Oh, come on, Willa. We never talk about this stuff. something from the Keller Realm. Well, I don't even know what a Keller Realm is. Hmm. Yep. Only one way to find out. Explore! Buddy, I want to get down. you know.
Magic ice on its back.
Also, mm. would amaze even Brom. Mm. Mom would love it too. Even a drill bass can't catch us. You know, I've been thinking. <laughs> if dark ice makes you bad, does true ice make you good? attacked if they were made of true ice. because of those severed branches, right? <laughs> Let's see if we can help him. Look at the magic ice shards there. Do you think we can use that to fix the branches?
If I don't give you that ice, it's all for nothing. Coming back!
magic ice. Just what we need.
Sure ways can create life too? Wow, I never knew. If true eyes can create life, do you think dark eyes can mess with it somehow? But it would make sense, right? Dark eyes corrupts. Is that the word? Did someone take the element out of your stew or something? I just wondered, that's all. So we've got the jewelberry fruit and the frozen tear. Next up, the culture. That's us one step closer to the heart of the blue. Hey, Mom. Maybe. Yeah, right. You know, there's a lot of dark ice up here. And true ice, too. You think the heart of the blue is connected somehow? Or even to the void? I do not think too much. You'll see. So, you know, I've been having these weird dreams. Well, what do you dream about, Lump? Right. So, just food. I should have known. Is it magic? Ah, you youngsters with your endless desire for ruinous magics. Sometimes craftsmanship and beauty are their own rewards. Now go. Your presence here means that time is short. There is much to do. Thank you, Orn, for everything. It's been an honor. Yeah! <laughs> Remember, child, when darkness surrounds everything and all seems lost, Sometimes a little spark is all that's needed to light the greatest of fires. <sighs> you have outstayed your welcome. Away. Leave me. I know, I know. We should get back to Rom.
guess we'll never know. Right. One of life's great mysteries. But it was definitely a shovel. you're really the last Yeti? If there are others? I know how you feel. That's how I think about Mom, too. Maybe after we find the Heart of the Blue, we can go visit some milk tie. Hey, bro! We had the most amazing adventure! I think you'll help us pass the blizzard. This is nice. You have found incredible treasure. Yeah, like he said. Ha! That's the most incredible thing Brom ever heard. It would make a great song. Thanks. Oh, speaking of songs. Buddy, I've tweaked our song a little. Should I play it? Spell mm -hmm. Songer, don't fail me now. needed, my friends. It was Brom's pleasure. So, what happens now? Are we gonna try and cross the blizzard? No. Uh, now we sleep. The blizzard is a challenge we face in the morning. You know, Brom, back in the fortress, we found something scary. <laughs> Don't be like that! You know the void is really scary stuff. The, the void? Uh, stop there, little friend. Tell me exactly what you saw. Well, there was a carving of one of those giant tentacle monsters and statues of the three sisters. Cyrilda, Avarosa, and Lysandra. But one doesn't want to talk about these things. <clears throat> you see? Do you know something about this, Brom? Some story? Well, I've heard, of course, about the War of the Three Sisters uh, thousands of years ago. Yetis fought with the Three Sisters against the Void, and they won. Thanks to Lysandra, I think, and a secret weapon. But the Yetis paid a great price. What price? Legend doesn't say. Maybe our blue friend can tell us more. Ah, <sighs> well, um... Giant Poro is right. <laughs> it's time to sleep, little hero. Legends need to be fresh. Okay. But tomorrow... Tomorrow, we'll be legends, Nunu. Together. Are we getting any closer, Mom? Are we on the right track? I would tell you if you were heading in the wrong direction, Nunu. But are we close? When will we get there? What else do I need to know? You need to be patient, Nunu. You'll find everything in the heart of the blue. 
Believe, Nunu. Believe. I don't think I'll ever know more than you. What, what is the heart of the blue, child? It's a candle. Right, Mom? A candle? What do you mean, it's a candle? A candle for the night. I thought that's what you said. Did I get it wrong? No, child. You didn't get it wrong. I was just testing you. What else can you tell me about it? Um, a fire for the darkness, you said. Also, it's a weapon? What kind of weapon? Wielded by whom? Are you okay, Mom? I'm okay, Nunu. Why? Is something the matter? Um, no. Everything's fine, I guess. So, what do I do next? You carry on, my son. You endure. That's it? That's it. Trust in Willem. Trust in yourself. You'll get there, Nunu. I promise. <gasps> Caravan. Where is everyone? Mom? Mom, are you here? Mom! I can save you! His boy are so close. So close to the Freljord's darkest secret. Does the Yeti really know where he's going? And why go there? The creature will only find pain. It is the same pain I carry. The agony of losing your closest kin. Or is it something else? Did the Yeti hide something there? Something I can't see, even when I puppet the boy's dreams. An ultimate weapon called the Heart of the Blue. Oh, that foolish hero, the Heart of the Freljord is with them. I'll deal with him. Then the Yeti will bring me its secrets. You are where the blizzard used to be, little one. It worked? It worked! Look! Guys, look! The winged mountain! We made it! Bomb! Your mighty stew of heroes worked! <laughs> the protector of the Freljord strikes again! Thanks, Brom! Come on, guys! Hmm. His eyes... That boy is... curious. Uh, Brom thinks it is time for first hero lesson.
world's greatest hero has fallen. Now, Yeti, you're next. You will wield this heart of the blue for me. At any cost. Brom's gonna be okay. Right, Willem? Right? fight with stories and songs. It's better that way. Because, you know, I think this is my favorite. Volley bear sniffing a flower after an epic fight. This kid has humor. Well, it has to be a kid, right? With a head full of cool things, like me.
magic freezes an entire army. Well, the ice witch maybe could, but it looks like they were frozen a long time ago. I almost felt like a Nevia! <laughs> 
What's that weird sphere? Oh. You can move it? Really? Hey, I was thinking, you know how Brom said Lissandra fought the void? I don't understand. Doesn't doing a good thing make you a good person? Not great to disagree, I guess. Are you okay, Willem? Pal, I have no clue where we are. Let's look around. Hey, Will, what's this? I can see it's a hoop. What I meant was, why is it here? I wonder what it does. There's only one way to find out, I guess. Mm. What do you mean a bad idea? You need to lighten up, buddy. I'm gonna blow.
So, are we safe now? We're safe now, right? I'm like 99% sure we're safe now. so that you might live. Ha! He does not know! You have not told him! No matter. There is yet time. Behold, a true roar! Like you, Mr. Volleybear, sir. No. But you will be able to roar like yourself, Cub. A true roar, your true power, comes from within. Sure thing. I understand. My true roar comes from within. I don't get it. Now go. You have disturbed me long enough. I must rest. Gather my strength for what is to come. Oh. Exactly do we get out of here? We're looking for the Winged Mountain and... Ramshara. Of course you are. You are already there. 
Thank you. Thank you so much, oh great and wise bear. We will meet again, Clem. One day. On the eve of battle. And if you haven't found what you are searching for by then, I'll kill you both myself. <laughs> Good one, Mr. Molly Bear. He's not really gonna kill us, right, Willump? Uh, Willump. We made it, Willump! What did the Folly Bear call this place? Ramshara? Come on, Willump! We should be celebrating! We fought the Folly Bear and lived to tell the tale, and now we're finally at the Winged Mountain! Well, anyway, looks like we gotta find a way inside. So is there Yetis, right? They are massive! Well? Well... You know this place, don't you? You could tell me. You've been here before, right? Okay, okay. I guess we'll just open the door. do something with the door, right?
Tell me anything, right? I don't get it, Willow. We're family now, weren't we? I, I thought that meant that you wouldn't have to hide anything from me anymore. I just wish Bob was here. I'm sure he wouldn't keep secrets from me. down. They look like yetis, but different. Wild and frightening. It looks like they were fighting each other. How did they get caged in this ice? Willem? Hey, buddy, are you okay? Those yetis don't look anything like Willem. Are they related somehow? Buddy? Buddy! Mm. I've 
never seen him so sad. Hello? Hey, Willump. In that note I can't be found, I miss my people. Is that how it feels for you to be here? We'll see each other soon, right? Okay, if you're sad. Sorrow is an ice wolf. Did you ever hear that say? My mom wrote a song about it. Maybe it's an old tie thing. It goes, Sorrow is an ice wolf. However much it howls, be careful not to feed it. I think I understand it. You want to avoid ice wolves if you can, but, well, some stuff's just gonna hurt you. It's part of life, I guess. Yep, Sorrow's a nice wolf, buddy. But you have me. Always. from Shara me, Willem. Home? Your home? Or the home of all Yetis? All? Willem, this is amazing! the city?
magic no for spell songer. Yeti's playing drums? What are they doing? Did the Yeti worship Anivia? More complicated, huh? Treasures? Wait, treasures? The heart of the blue! Next, open that big one! I wish I could have seen this place back when it was full of yetis! And the slides. Were they used to get around or for fun, too? <laughs> fun so! Oh, no. Bulldog! 
many of them here? Oh. Wow! So everyone here was equal? Oh. That sounds a lot like the no time. Except bigger and hairier. The second drum is closer. Progress, Willem. is strong, right? That's deep, Willem. Corruption only seems stronger, but it's weak. Yeti philosopher!
a drum! Look! Shards of magic ice! Just what we need! Willem, can you let me down? Well, I'm going to explore a little. Bye! turns the statue.
with the Yetis in the war against the Void, right? And they won? Together? Sacrifice? I don't get it. They saved the world, right? Patience? Come on, Willem. I'm a kid. I don't do patience. could make true ice? How is that possible? How do they do it? And what do they do with it? I do not ask too many questions. I'm just excited is all. What else could the Yetis do? Do they have any other powers? I'll find out soon enough. What's just up ahead? Now you're teasing me, pal. Do you think the Yeti and the Notai would have liked each other? I met our tribes. So much of what they did feels the same. Not just eating, silly, but 
the stories and songs, too. I'm sure the Yeti and the Notai would have been best friends. Look, that goes up. contains your history, Willem? So everything the Yeti ever did is recorded here? Let's hope the Heart of the Blue is just one of those. Come on.
see what the first step is. There's a drawing inside. But it doesn't make a lot of sense, right? <laughs> yeah. We need to tidy those up. Hmm, I wonder how. Yeti's fighting. They were like those frozen Yetis we saw at the entrance. Oh, so all Yetis were like that before. Before what? Okay, okay, I'll find it out soon enough. Next mural! Seems like the key. <laughs> this one. What does it mean? Oh, so the stronger Yeti felt Betty. And Anivia was there to see it all. I can't wait for the next one! <laughs> Other. I'll look closely next time. Transform the Yetis. Oh. You know, Willem, Anivia is also the mother of all oh, Notai. Maybe someday I'll wake up blue and with four arms. <laughs>
Two Yetis were fighting. One won, but he decided to forgive the loser. And Anivia saw everything and gave you four arms, many horns, and blue fur as a prize, right? And the power of true ice, of course. Wait, the power of true ice from her heart! The heart of the blue is the heart of Anivia! We were right! We're in the right place, Willem. It has to be very close. We're so close to solving it, Willem! So the heart of the blue is really close, right? So this picture, wait, is that three sisters? It is. That's Avarosa, that's Cyrilda, and that's Lysandra. It's gotta be. And this is how the Yetis and the sisters joined forces to fight the Void? Then all Mom's stories were true. But I thought the Yetis were peaceful. Did what had to be done? Right. It must have been so scary. Wait, were you there, Willem? Willem? Look at this. That's really... something. So, what's happening here, Willem? Huh? Lysandra the Ice Witch? Stole the true ice magic from the Yetis? <laughs> then she sacrificed her sisters? Sacrificed everyone to win the war? I've got so many questions. If all the Yetis were gone, then who painted this? It looks so... Angry. Crazy, even. It was... You? Oh, well, I'm... I'm so, so sorry. You don't have to say any more. Wow. Look! A Nivy's chamber! The heart of the blue's gotta be up that pedestal! Almost there, Mom. I'm gonna find it. I'm gonna find you. It's... It's empty. Please! <laughs> 
I have to know. This is our whole adventure. This is... Mom! Please. Sign. Do you hear something? I thought I heard something. Do you hear me? Hello? He just doesn't see me. And what are those things? I don't know what they are. But they seem scary. And they're bewitching Willow? I have to stop this. What if they're blocking the path? Let's get past them somehow.
Buddy. Talk about a day! We find your home, Willem. We explore Ramshara. We get to the room that holds the Heart of the Blue, and it's not even there! What was the point? Sleep? How can you sleep? You saw what I saw, right? There was true ice, dark ice, 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 even Anivia descending from the heavens to give the Yetis a piece of her heart. A piece of Anivia's heart. That's got to be the heart of the blue, right? We got to find out what happened to it. There's no need to snap at me just because you can't remember. <laughs> What? What do you mean you had it? When? So you were its guardian? Why didn't you say so? What did you do with it? Come on, Willem. I thought we were friends. I don't understand why you can't just tell me the truth. You do know that the Heart of the Blue is going to take me to my mom, right? So where is it, Willem? <laughs> where it belongs? What does that mean? More riddles? You're as bad as mom! Oh, you got to be kidding me! You're going to sleep now? <sighs> Fine. We'll talk in the morning. Where it belongs. What progress have you made on your quest, child? We're getting closer, I think. Willem and me found Ramshara. Do you know it? The city of the Yeti. What did you see? It's amazing, Mom. You won't believe it. Go on. Every wall has magic drawings that tell you stories, Mom. Did you know about true ice? True ice? Where? Where, Where child? child? Well, there was this room, and there was this ancient gem. And Willem told me that the gem gives the Yeti's power to make true ice. Do you think, maybe... Is the gem still there? Mom? Are you okay? Is the gem still there, child? No, Willem said he took it. The Yeti, their city, Ramshara. What? What are you saying, Mom? Be calm, Nunu. You're almost there. You have all you need. Feel the heart of the blue. Wait, what?
So close. Feel the candle, Nunu. Gaze into the light. Keep running. Keep running. Don't give up. Serilda, the wordless. Avarosa, the soundless. And me, Lysandra, the... I don't need my sight to remember how daring you were, my dear sisters. I see your faces all the time. I'm here again, alone, where it all began thousands of years ago. And as before, a sacrifice must be made. It was here. The beating heart of Anivia, the heart of the blue, my only chance to restore the true ice. The Yeti knows, and he will answer to me, even if I have to rip his soul apart. Peace by peace. Step away from the creature, child. Get away from Willem! Willem? <laughs> so it has been given a name. Oh, child. Do you not realize what this creature is? He is... He's my friend. No, child. This... Beast... Is nothing more than a weapon. A weapon to be used... In the war to come. What are you talking about? A great darkness stirs. A darkness that threatens the entire friend lord. It almost destroyed this land last time. It could very well destroy all Runeterra. This... Willem... holds the secret to a power that can stop it. True ice. True ice? I... I don't understand. I do not expect you to. But answer me this, child. Would you sacrifice one life to save millions? One life to save the world? I guess, but he's my friend. Your friend? I sacrificed my kin, child. My beloved sisters. You did? Yes, because even my dearest family was meaningless when I faced down the end of the world. 
That's true bravery, child. To be able to sacrifice what you love most for the greater good. I'll tell you one last time. Step away from the creature, child. As if I thought it could be any other way. Come, creature. I have a purpose for you elsewhere. Willem? She's taken Willem. No. Willem! Willem. I'm sorry. If only I was stronger, I could have. I'm so cold. Nunu. Nunu. No, no. Stand up, my son. It does not end like this. Mom, where are you? I am always with you, Nunu. In your heart and in your mind. Mom. I don't know what to do. As are all your friends, Nunu. Hold them in your heart, and they will give you strength. I don't understand. But focus them in your mind, and they will give you power. Strength? Power? I'm talking about Brom. Focus, my son. Mom? Mom? Where'd you go? Brom? Where are you? I'm so cold. Brom? thing was lost in giant underground city made of of lights and slides when a warm feeling in heart and head and even mustache pulled me this way that sounds awesome yes but sad you will never know you do not have mustache What's that sound? It is best you do not see little one. You remember what I said back on bridge? The best hero advice? Run? Good idea. Woohoo! This will be getting bumpy. Put your arms around Grom's neck and hold on tight! Aye aye, Captain! No, not so tight! Grom still needs to breathe! <laughs> Hilarious thing Brom has ever heard! You have been buried in snow before, yes? 
<laughs> Can you hang out with Wilma? <laughs> you kind of get used to it. <laughs> and speaking of Wilma, how exactly are we going to rescue him? Uh, I think... Any ideas? Nope. No ideas. It's all right. We're doomed, and that's it. You can't think like that, no, no. There's always hope, little hero. Ah, if only we had more stew, then we would have the best idea. Stew? The Calero! That's it! Brom, you're a genius! I am? <laughs> I am! <laughs> and why am I genius? you something. I hear you. I learned that Lysander sacrificed her family, her sisters, to save the world. She told me that I needed to sacrifice Willem too, or the world would be destroyed. What I'm thinking is, is it right to sacrifice someone to save everyone? Deep thoughts, little hero. Hard choices. Maybe it's too big question for a pro. But... But? But I've always believed that for every two hard choices, there's a secret number three. I... I like that. <laughs> find the way inside. But there are so many guards. What do we do? We do nothing. Rome will distract the guards while you sneak inside. I love a distraction. What will it be? Oh, I know. You can dress up as a giant Puro and talk our way inside. A wonderful, if not a little strange idea. But no. So what are we going to do? Brom will fight them. Oh. You know how Brom tell you he beat four armies with only his left hand? This will be fifth. Okay. Brom is gone. Willem's captured. Time to be a hero, Nunu. Okay, how do I find Willem? Think, no, no, think. <gasps> Willem's a prisoner, so he's probably being kept in the dungeon. So I need to find dungeons. Let's go rest. <sighs> Frost guards! I better be careful. Do we know who it is? Who would dare attack us here at the Citadel? 
We don't know. Report is there's an entire army at the gate. An army called Brom. Nothing to report. For being such mighty warriors, their eyes are pretty weak. Nothing to report. Guess I should also use the other gun. walls have been breached by Braum. What is a Braum? Are you kidding me? The heart of the Freljord? Biceps for trees? Door for a shield? Come on! Yeah, come on. soldiers spent their entire lives serving Lysandra. It's kind of amazing how loyal they are. I always imagined they must really, really love her. But listening to some of them talk, I don't know. Maybe they don't love Lysandra after all. Maybe they're afraid of her. Everything's quiet.
for the glory of Lathana. Blessed be our mother. Blessed be our mother. Hey! For the glory of Lathana. Blessed be our mother. <gasps> Wanna see me again? Nothing except the blissful cold. Nothing to report. Should I hit it with the snowball? the howling abyss. It feels older here. Or am I imagining it? It's... It's really something. I... I don't like this feeling. Better move, Nuno. Fast!
called the Ross Guard Citadel, right? Nothing more.
says she needs Willem to save the world. Would you sacrifice Willem to save millions, she said. But it can't be that simple, can it? Just can't be. What did Rome say? No problem only has two solutions. There's always a secret option number three. Well, I'm not sure what secret option number three is exactly, but I know I have to find it. For the glory of the Sanders.
Okay, no, no. This is it. Take a deep breath. You can do this. Come on, Nunu. Be like Brom. No fear. Yo, he's close. I'm coming, Noom. I'm coming. Are you okay? Great. Oh, great. Now I have to figure out how to free you, buddy. Hang on. Mm. 
Everything okay, Willem? <laughs> Same for me. <laughs> 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 
the exit. Now we just need to open it. Um, what does it look like to you? A pendulum, right? Let's see if we can swing it. Oh, Willa, can you make it swing for me? It's beating up. to get this area. Mm. Voila! Help me with this magic ice! <laughs> now it's a lighter! Going up! Yes! I'll see you near the other cage! like it. Don't be 
are so underrated. Okay, Willump. Where are we? Well, whatever's down here, we'll face it together. Right, buddy? displays of friendship. A warmth to thaw even the frail yard itself. <clears throat> but what if there is no frail yard? I told you before what is at stake here, child. This willump. Or the world. And yet, here you are. And here I'm staying. With willump. Then you have made your choice. To throw away the world in the pointless pursuit of friendship. Your naivete dooms us all. No. I'm choosing another path. I know the sacrifices that you made, and why, but I can't do the same. What's the point in living without your family beside you? <laughs> Precisely is this other path you speak of. Enlighten me. I don't know yet, but we'll find it together. No problem ever only has one or two easy solutions. There's always a secret option number three. You just gotta look hard to see it. Sight? You talk to me about sight. I may be blind, child. But my vision is clear, and I see your doom. My trial is
Your time has passed. <laughs>
Did, did we win? Hmm. I think... I think we... <laughs> you cannot use ice to destroy its own queen. Such delusion. The hourglass runs short. There is no time for this futile dance. It's clear now you are fool enough to give everything for this beast, child. So, let me see how far this friendship goes. Wait! Ah! What are you doing? strong enough. Mom was wrong. I'm just not strong enough. But you are strong enough, Nunu. Mom? I'm so proud of you, my son. But I failed, Mom. I can't say Willump and I didn't find the heart of the blue. You can save him, Nunu. And you have found it. You're wrong, Mom. I have it. I couldn't. Do you remember what the heart of the blue is? I don't know what it is. You never told me. A fire for the darkness? A candle for the night, but I don't know what that means. It means you need it to be somewhere dark before you could find it. You know where it is, Nunu. You feel it now, don't you? No. I don't know. It can't be. Say it. Will gave me the heart of the blue? He did. So, where it belongs is with you, Nunu. But why? You'll have to ask Willem. I feel like I'll lose you if I touch it, Mom. Is that true? In a way, yes. Then I can't. I won't lose you again. You'll play my songs, I trust. You'll tell stories about me. Yes, but... Listen to me, Nunu. You cannot kill a story. You cannot kill a song. So long as there are voices to sing and ears to hear, a song lives forever. As will I. Okay? Okay. But right now... You have a brother who needs your help. A brother? Willem! You know what you must do? I do. And are you ready? I am. Then let's go.
后啊。Bob, you're okay. Is it really you? What happened? It all feels like a dream. I thought I lost you, Willem. <laughs> What did I tell you? Five armies, left arm, no problem. A new record for the mighty. Oh, uh, Brom is thinking this maybe is not best time for reunion, huh? Survive first, big fluffy hugs later. Come, giant bottle, check. Little hero, check. Let's go, let's go, let's go. <laughs> ah, yes. <laughs> you found your heart of the blue. You defeated the evil queen. And you saved the biggest Poro Brom has ever seen. <laughs> I know, I know, but I love Poro. <laughs> What can I say? You are the finest of Yeti, and I am honored to have fought alongside you, my friend, my Willem. You are lucky to have such a friend, little hero. But then, you too are more than you seem. Together, you are unstoppable. So what happens now, Brom? What are you gonna do? This is the Freljord, Nuno. Always there is someone who needs help. Just over the horizon. That is where you will find Brom. You can come with us, you know. We make a pretty good trio. Indeed we do, little hero. But the mountain must stand alone. Besides, Brom wants to hear your stories the next time we meet, huh? Then we'll make sure they're the best you've ever heard. I'll get bigger and stronger and be just like you! Oh, you are already strong, Nuno. In ways I cannot imagine. But you will never be like Brom. Huh? Why? You will never know loneliness. Sorry? What are you sorry for? That's okay, buddy. How come you never told me? To hide it from the Ice Queen. Huh. I just worry I'm not worthy of having the Heart of the Blue. Thanks, Willump. You're so wise. Now? But I don't have anything to use it on. Spellsonger! You're right! It, it broke! Okay. So, how does this work exactly? Wow! It's fixed! Okay. Now what? thinking, Mom once told me that all great stories need a great title. So, what should we call this story? I love it, Willem! It's just... perfect! The brisk, chilling air is calling and out there we're free to run and jump and live so wildly 
Head first we'll go tumbling to places unknown With nothing but the stars to light our way And though the sun may set at night Tomorrow will look so bright Cause home, home is when you're by my side Together we'll say it through And I hope That we won't drift apart Even though things change Without you it's not the same I know it's true Life's better when it's me and you A joke? <laughs> so, a Yeti walks into an inn and walks up to the bar. Oh, wait, no. It wasn't a Yeti. It was a Drew Mask. Or was it a Krug? No. Oh, it was definitely a Drew Mask. I gotta think about it. How does it go again? Gotcha! I remember now. The joke! So, a true vast walks into me and walks up to the bar. The innkeeper takes one look says, hey, we don't serve yetis in here. Did you not read the sign? Mm. No, I definitely got that wrong. It was a yeti after all. And that wasn't even the right punchline. Ah, sorry, buddy. Yeah, bro did tell me the joke I was trying to tell you. Why? I know, but I ruined it. He tells it much better. Me 
for an instant, but for the first time in an age, I could see, and what a sight it was, the power, the power that I have sought for so long, wielded by a child. He has the Yeti magic. No, he is the Yeti magic. He is the heart of the blue. How has this happened? Was it all our fault? In manipulating the Yetis, did I forge the need for this boy to exist? I was wrong about so many things. I am not the savior I thought I was. Such power. Such innocence. The boy is a blade. Not me. And certainly not the Yeti. Yes. I must sharpen that blade for what is yet to come. The North shall have its frozen messiah. The savior to face the abyss. The hourglass runs short. No. The hourglass is broken. The time is now. I shall watch him. As they watch me. 